I'm Jackie Ward, live in San Jose this morning, developing in Santa Clara County. The sheriff's office is investigating a shooting that happened in this very driveway just hours ago, and we can see bullet holes from where we're standing. This is not the first bullet hole that we've seen here this morning. We spoke to the man who lives in this house at 494 Richmond Ave, and he said he woke up to several gunshots and someone yelling really loudly around 1030 last night. Then he heard a car speed off. He said one person was shot in his driveway. Then that person ran towards his backyard and hopped the fence. So the victim may have gotten away, but the witness believes at least two people were detained for the shooting. He thinks another suspect was shot, suffered a flesh wound, and was still able to get away. We aren't too far from San Jose City College. Adrian Alcaraz says in the two and a half years he's lived here, there's been two to three shootings. That was pretty nervous because, you know, if you're in bed and you, you hear that shot, it's like, hey, these bullets could fly through walls and one could have hit me while I'm asleep. So, yeah. This area was littered with shell casings earlier, and bullet holes could be seen in a lot of nearby parked cars. That's what some people are waking up to this morning. The sheriff's office was canvassing the area earlier. They're trying to find any clues that would help in their investigation. They are the ones handling this case. But just before this live shot, we spoke to yet another person who lives about seven houses down. He said minutes before this shooting, he was out walking his dog. He feels very lucky to not have been caught in that crossfire. But unnerving, that's the word that these neighbors seem to be using this morning because of all the activity that's happened in recent years. In San Jose, Jackie Ward, KPIX 5.